Hello guys, how are you? And welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to level 10 to the Prem. And welcome back to Hallam FC. I'm John, aka Old Mansuda. And things have been going pretty well for us overall. We can't really complain too much. Had one or two little blips here and there, but overall it's been pretty good for us. I left you after the 3-1 win over Ferriby, uh, North Ferriby that was, as you can see we played absolutely fantastic, a really good result for us. Kyle and getting injured was the only sort of blip we had there. We then played uh, non-stall uh, Miners Welfare I think they're called, uh, drew one all, it was a rubbish match, nothing really happened, two penalties was about the most interesting thing that happened, um, both of them were weird penalties as well, it was just a one of those boring games that you get sometimes. We then played champion, beat them 6-2, absolutely fantastic. Sean East, Jack Steele, Husband and Watson getting the goals. Ryan Wright getting an own goal as well. They did get two goals. We would have preferred them not to, but it happens. Uh, but a 6-2 win overall, absolutely fantastic. We then played Swallow Nest twice in a row, once in the league, beating 1-0 with Mitch Husband getting the goal. We then beat them 4-1. Uh, in the cup, as you can see, they're absolutely fantastic. Dutton K getting sent off was the only blip we had there. We then played Parkgate, and it was a boring game as well. One all. Andy Tony getting sent off really sort of ruined it for us. We had to go defensive after that. They got the goal back, but couldn't get a second. And it was just a rubbish game for us. It really didn't help us. We then played Brig in the cup, and we lost 3 0. It was just, yeah, we were absolutely shockingly bad. It was just terrible. Just no other words for it. We then played Harrogate Railway. Again, didn't play particularly well. We did get 3-1 up. And as you can see, they scored in the 86th and 89th minute. I was so annoyed with our team. We just threw it away at the very, very end. Then Crabtree getting sent off as well didn't particularly help us. Um, I'm not sure what happened. It just, we fell to pieces towards the end uh, there. We then played Glass Houghton. Beat them 2-0. Really good there. Andy Tony getting a goal. Phil Lindley uh, getting the goal, own goal as well. Uh, didn't play fantastic, but we got the win, which was the most important thing. We've got Armthorpe today, which is going to be a difficult game. But... It does mean we are still top of the league. Four points clear of North Ferriby. Uh, five points clear of Skegness. But Skegness do have a game in hand over us. And I think North Ferriby will... Uh, they've actually got Skegness got two games in hand over us. Uh, I didn't realise that. Uh, but North Ferriby got a game in hand over us after today. Because they aren't playing. They've got a league match. They're in the County's East League Cup uh, semi-finals or something like that. I think. So, unfortunately, these teams... Even though we've got a couple of points clear of them, I have got a good chance to catch up. So we've really got to make sure that we uh, keep our winning ways and all that sort of stuff. We have got to play Skegness. We have got to play Brig as well. So two games there we really do need to win because Brig aren't too far away either. Uh, so yeah, basically with about nine games to go, we need to try and make sure we win every single one or get good results because as you can see, we've got some big games and we've got some games that we desperately do need to make sure that we uh, win the likes of Briggs, the likes of Shit uh, Skegness and Broston, Maine, probably Hall Road Rangers are somewhere around there, I think up there as well, seventh. So, you know, we've got, we've got to play some of the top of the league sides as well. So it's going to be a difficult one. Squad wise, uh, Nathan Duncan K is out on suspension. Apart from that, though, everyone else is looking pretty fit. I am starting to look at getting rid of some of these players as well. So everyone from like Russ Foyston up to maybe William Stewart, I'm thinking about getting rid of at the moment. They're just probably surplus to requirements. Uh, these lower guys like Sean East, Hornshaw, John Johnson have actually been pretty good for us and they are on youth contracts. So there's no point getting rid of them. But these ones here, probably, we are looking at maybe getting rid of very, very soon. Apart from that, though, everything else is looking pretty good. Finances now are all pretty good at the moment. So let's get into the game. And while we're getting into the game, remember to subscribe and like and all that sort of stuff. I haven't really banged on about it too much. I do always say at the end of the video, but I'm going to start saying it a little bit more because, you know, if you aren't, if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe to the channel or like the video or get some interaction going because it helps me so much it helps my channel so much and the guys who do do it you are fantastic and my support for a small channel like me has been brilliant but you know i look at my stats and that and there's so many of you that just don't click anything so please find it in your heart just click subscribe or click like on the video it would help so much apart from that though guys let's get into the game and it's going to be Deitch and Goal it's going to be Sutherland Barnes, Crabtree and Kerslack is going to come out on the right there Forrest, Atkinson, Dempsey and Tony are in the middle uh, in fact actually I might just change that a little bit I think let's have we'll have Atkinson out for Hornshaw Hornshaw can come completely out for Husbands We'll have husbands in there because he is one of our better players overall. Um, 
I think, oh, I feel he is anyway. So he scored nine goals. We could do with him for the goal scoring uh, capabilities, if anything else. Um, so that's our midfield still on Flowers on the wings. Watson up front. Overall, we should do pretty well. It's like I said, it's going to be a tough game. Armstrong, Armstrong aren't a bad side. It's going to be a difficult game, but it's a game we should be winning. You know, all these games we really should be winning. We're going to say passionately. Um, what can we say? We've been on a good run lately. Go out there and press. We'll just say we are favourites. It's gone down okay, I guess. Give them a quick positive talk as well. And then we'll get into the game and see how we get on. Hopefully we can do pretty well. This formation has been okay. We've had one or two little blips with it. Um, I think it still needs tweaking just a little bit with some of the players that we've got. But overall it's not been doing too bad. So we cut that out quite nicely. Husbands with the ball gets it out wide now. And it's Charles Flowden with a shot. And the keeper makes a good save against post almost it hit looked like he's going for corner anyway and still with the corner now puts it in can we get something here we can't quite get it Tony's going to pick it up though as he I hate when they do that it stopped the ball and then run a mile um, past it uh, O'Sullivan gets tackled though and still with the ball now can he get his husband he does husband coming forward he gives it to Dempsey Dempsey now with a long ball forward to Fowden Fowden's got a chance can he get across him he does get it in to Wilson Watson even, get in there Wilson Watson, get in there, that's what we wanted, 1-0, get in there, great goal, Watson re came really late actually, but it was a cracking run by him, as Flowden gets the ball, I thought he'd messed up a little bit, the player got a bit close, but then Watson comes in and just absolutely smashes it and just gets it into that bottom left hand corner, and with 5 minutes gone, we are 1-0 up and things are looking pretty good for us, we've got another chance here, Watson with a free kick puts it in, Oh, that was close. We just couldn't quite get it on target. And with 10 minutes gone, we are looking like a team wanting to win the league at the moment. 15, 16, 17 minutes gone. It's Armsworth with a chance. Though. They have the ball now down this line. They try. Oh, he rides the tackle pretty well. And they cut it inside to Osborne. Osborne with the ball. But he makes a terrible... Oh, we should have done a bit better there. We didn't really control it very well. But we steal the ball here. Dempsey with the ball. King gets a steal. He does steal now. We've got two players coming in. As he takes a shot, it's a good save by the keeper. He should maybe have looked to actually have uh, squared it a little bit more. And I think take a shot. But still now with the corner. Can we get a second off the corner? Put the ball in. We can't get it there. But Barnes is going to get there. He doesn't get there, and it's the end of the highlight. We're going to shout and just demand a little bit more from the team. 26, 27 minutes gone. Like I said, we're doing pretty well. Stats-wise, you look at it, we are playing pretty good. But we need to just, I think we feel like we need another goal. So as our defender just stands there, so they get a free one in, and he somehow gets it in. Luke Noble with the goal. Absolutely terrible defending by us. Really should have done a lot better than that. I mean, he slid in and got the goal. Snowden there with a cheeky pass. We should do a bit more. He tried jumping for it, but then Osborne with a good cross in. And here, I mean, we we need to defend better than that. I mean, I know some of it is 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 level ten standards, but we should be defending a lot better than that. With thirty seven minutes gone, let's say get creative as we try to get back into this. Oh, that's got to be a red card. Aspin's got to be off, hasn't he? Surely he is off. No, he's not. What? They've substituted him, it looks like, instead. Uh, I can't believe he didn't get sent off for that. Uh, right, what can we say apart from assertively, far from pleased, we want a little bit more. We want a little bit better. We need to get another goal uh, as they come forward now, as they play it quite nicely. But a good tackle there by Tony. Tony gets it back to Kerslake. Kerslake to Crabtree. Crabtree launches it up, but we can't quite get it. And... It's a chance for Armsworth to come forward as they start playing quite well. They get it out to Sodin. Sodin with the ball as he knocks it back to O'Sullivan, who's probably been their best player overall. And a long ball forward. Surely we are going to get this here. Crabtree, oh, I thought you were going to make a mistake then. And it's a massive long ball forward as Flowers and gets a chance here, he makes a mistake, and he gets a chance, takes a shot, and can't quite get it on target. It would have been absolutely fantastic. They did have a play sent off. I am not going mad. I thought they hadn't had a player sent off. Uh, right. Demand more. We need a goal. We need something out of this. Uh, I think we might have to change it. Let's change. Right, we're going to change things up a little bit. Uh, we're going to go for a four-four-two. Who's not playing particularly well in the midfield at the moment? Everyone's playing all right actually, but I think husbands can come up here. He can play as a striker as well. So we're going to have you as a pressing forward, defending, and we're going to go for it. We are going to go for it. Two up front. Can we get the second goal? Still puts the ball in. We can't quite get it. He's going to get a second chance. Still puts the ball in again. It goes past everyone. But Dempsey's there. He puts the ball in again. And again, we don't quite 
get it. We should have done a little bit better there. Sodding with the ball now. Gives it to Sutherland with a long ball forward as they knock it back. But we do get it. And now Flowden's got a bit of room out here. Can he get across him? He tries to, but he gets tackled. And again, it's a chance for Armsworth because they got one-on-one -on -one now. Osborne with a shot. And it's a good save by the keeper. Right. We really need to do something here because it's just nothing's working. We're going to go down to positive at the moment and just see. But it's so Sullivan with the free kick. We do clear it. Still picks it up and now gets it out to Husbands. Husbands can get it to Flowers and Flowers and with a chance. He's got to get past one player. He does, but it's a poor shot. And with 63 and 64 minutes gone, we still look like we are the better side. We've had 15 shots. We really should be scoring more goals. 60, 70 minutes gone. Uh, at the moment, 72, 73, shout, right, show some passion, that's all we can say to them, as Watson now with a bulb gives it to Kersak, Kersak puts a cross into Husbands, Husbands got brought down, it's a penalty, that is uh, something we need, is, is it Husband taking it, I think it is, uh, as he stands up, Kersak, nice Kersak, Kersak with a bulb, Kersak with a goal, get in there, Kerslake, Kerslake, whatever his name is, with it. Seb Kerslake with the goal. First goal of the season for him actually is a penalty. Gives us a 2-1 lead with 15 minutes to go. And we have got an extra man as well. Right, what can we do? We need to make some substitutions. Oh, Sullivan's not playing fantastic for us at the moment. Uh, we haven't really got anyone who can go. Ollie Barnes could go out there actually. And oh, bring on ball there. Uh, who's looking really tired? I feel like we need to do something in the midfield. Uh, Dempsey's not looking great, so we're going to bring Carl Atkinson on for him. And is there anything else we could really look at doing? Let's bring John Johnson on as well there and just see. Can we see out the last 10 minutes of this game? We're going to go to back to balance. Fifth, five minutes left to go. Probably not even that. We've got a chance with the ball here, maybe. Ball with a free kick, Brig winning, which is not good. We could, oh, he's told uh, equalised. That's fantastic news for us. As Atkinson with the ball now puts it out, Flowden can get it, gets the header on. Watson takes it nicely, tries to get the shot off, but they just managed to get a toe. Skegness are losing as well, which is a fantastic result for us. 92 minutes gone, one minute left. Come on, can we see this out? It's been a terrible game for really. We haven't played particularly well, but we get the win. That is the most important thing, and we'll say passionately of nice victory. Well done, lads. Like I said, we didn't play. For Fantastic, but we got the win, which is most important against Armthorpe Welfare. East Hole next as well. Another game. They're in 18th. We really should be winning that game overall. But let's uh, see how we get on in the league and that sort of stuff. And if you enjoyed that game, again, I said before at the beginning of the game, remember to hit that subscribe button. Uh, right. What happened? So, who was the results? Brig did lose. That's fantastic for us. It puts us a couple more points clear of them. Uh, and the other one was Skegness. They drew in the end. So only one point. They do have an extra game a game in hand over us though. But it gives us a little bit of a breathing room. Which is absolutely fantastic for us. That's something we definitely needed. We should have played a little bit better. We went down to 10 men for most of the game. But we got the result at the end of the day. So we'll take that. Hand defeat. Watson shines as Hallam win. We are like 26 games unbeaten now. We're doing fantastic, really. Overall, I couldn't, shouldn't complain too much there. Um, right. What in are we going to come back? That's the main thing. We are going to come back probably for the Skegness game now. It will probably be the last game of the season. Unless we're going to win the league sort of anywhere like Shelby or Roston, Maine or something like that. I'll come back for the game. We have, Whatever game it is, we're going to win the league, basically. I will come back for... Thank you for watching, guys. I really, really appreciate all the support. Remember to subscribe, like, all that sort of stuff, as I've been saying through the video. And uh, come follow me on Twitter and all that sort of stuff as well. I will see you on the very next episode. Bye for now.